When I was nine, I was told by a man that I should not bother with education. That I should instead only think about getting married when I get older. Now, I did not like his words, and I never will. But what his words did to me is let a new feeling grow inside of me. A feeling that has been growing since all the time. When I heard that my friend stopped coming to the park because her mum thinks girls should not be running or playing around, only boys can do that. When my 15-year-old cousin got forced to get married to a man 20 years older than her because she was a financial burden to her family and she had to be removed. When my other cousin, her husband, stopped her from finishing university and completing her studies. When I heard about FGM and that over 200 million girls are right now being affected by it. When I heard about hashtag MeToo floating on social media. Well, this feeling has always been growing. And only two years ago, when I learned the word feminism, I started to understand what it was. It was a fight against gender inequality. Since I was nine, I have seen women being treated like dirt and dust, small, sometimes invisible and unwanted. And now this is not only about girls, this is also about boys. Because I have seen them always hiding their pain and insecurities right inside so they don't cry. Because that is too girlish, that's too cowardly, a boy can't cry. But when they release all their burden, say men have anger issues. I mean, why? Why in the world can't we see both men and women at the same level? Why can't we give them the same rights, opportunities, respect, the same value? Why can't we do that? Well, I want to see change. I want to see mothers not being upset of having daughters. I want to see boys not being bullied for not liking sports. And that's only going to happen if we all work together. Now, I'm not a big fan of maths, but I would like to end my speech with one equation. <laughs> Men plus women equals... Thank you.